what's up y'all it's promise with a c and i am back with another video we just started make sure you like comment and subscribe you can see i just got off of work and i'm to this get into this get into this bread i realize i don't got no video saved up to just push out besides like small stuff the short ones i'm gonna still upload them but i'm gonna just show y'all how i make shirts whatever i'm doing y'all just working with me tonight so let's get straight into the video transfer paper i always use a different type if you look at my other videos i probably showed you i don't know which one is light and which one is dark that i have left so i'm scared to use something i don't know about i lay it down it's way too big too so this is where i went wrong because i noticed that people will tell y'all show y'all the good stuff and the outcomes, but they don't show y'all, we fuck up. So I just wasted, wasted this paper, like it didn't cost. But this is a good shirt, I guess. But when you put it on the words, oh, oh, oh wait a minute. Usually you would have needed to mirror this. I never used this. So actually I gotta go back on what I just said. Um most ones you have to flip and mirror like on vinyl but i didn't use this and i messed up with what i was saying with what i was saying but you usually would have to mirror it in order to lay it down because you see if you just put it down it's gonna say the s is gonna be it's gonna read from left to right like this which will be yeah left to right facing this way left to right this is how it would read but it's good but it's too big it's a little boy shirt so i have to shrink it down and make it smaller and i also want to test it i'm gonna test the light fabric on a dark shirt just to see how it comes out because i made i'm i'm gonna show y'all i made some grays and you can see the white background on the shirts but then i made some grays where you can't see it it blends to the shirt but if you look closely the everything is blending into the shirt but those colors are so vibrant that they still popped out but let me just get to it because i know i'm talking i'm just trying to educate y'all on transfer papers i never really use these ones so i'm learning right now as we speak i'm gonna let my iron heat up and when i'm doing shirts i'll do it on about Transfer papers, I do on about 315. No, that's regular, that's vinyl. I do it on about 340, 340-ish, I don't know. I really don't remember. I think, I don't know. I just stepped on something. Let's see how it come out. And I think I'm gonna work on this hoodie tonight, this jacket tonight. I also have, um, I give y'all a sneak peek. You see what's going on? I got scared. Smug, I thought this mug was broke. I guess I just have to fill it up with a lot of paper. And with the other one I use, I need to let it sit for about 20 to 30 minutes. So I wonder if I need to do that with this. Just did it for a third time. I put both on one. Y'all, I got videos coming. It's just videos that's real time consuming. Oh, you only get to see this if you watch my videos. Sneaky peeky. Y'all see it. Stop playing. Stop playing. Ain't done. This took forever. So, look at that. Look close. These was jingling in there. See, some of them still jingle. But they got glue on them, so they don't be jingling. Y'all, I hope this come out. Okay. 
coming out all right. It's coming out all right. Not too shabby. Not too shabby for a kid's shirt. the regular size they can have a regular size y'all so that means I just did all that and for what I guess she got these let me see what size the other shirt is. See, y'all, getting into this is frustrating. What size is this and what size is this? Both small. I did the shirt, first time using this. You seen I stretched it between. And I don't know where that stain comes from, but I'm gonna take some white paint to clear that up and some orange paint, just color match to fix it. matched everything looks so much better now I'm gonna do the other one and put the words on the back that's like painting stuff on a wall in case you're wondering no it's not dirty okay so always heat your surface make sure your surface is flat clean clear okay so this on the back i guess that's how we're doing it i'm trying to be careful because i feel like this paint is going to get on there and i don't feel like painting again <laughs> i literally was over there blending making them gray because y'all know i didn't have no gray paint uh, fabric paint center well, I'm putting my down more because I've seen some of the little kids with the shirts on and I'm like mm, that seems kind of hot so there we go I have my timer on for 30 seconds so 30 second timer and just go back and forth back and forth up down press put slightly on the corners a little more hold Hold, hold, hold. I'm gonna ease up. Ease up, ease up. I hope I did it long enough. The paper said 30, but online it said 40. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's not all the way down on this side. I do this. I've never seen anyone else really do it. But I just stretch it a little, just to get that stretch. And then I lay it down. And I go over it one more time. This picture is super stretched. I should have stretched it up and down instead of side to side. I'm 
stretch it out. Okay, let me go in with some white. Because, girl. Always take your time if you really can. I didn't know that these were needed tomorrow. I'm still, okay. Just went in right there with the white. Good girl. Baby girl. Where's crack? I'm putting on. It looks like I ironed a piece of hair onto it, y'all. Oh well. Boo. You in there. And that's how I do the shirts, guys. My first time using this, it's pretty cool. I really just have to rate it based off of what they say. And this is what I was saying when I said you have to mirror it. So you only have to mirror it if it is on the white transfer papers. If you use this brand, if you use the black one, dark transfer papers, you don't have to mirror it. To y'all, it's reading taste honey shirts, but to me, it's reading S Y A T Y N I T S E R U S A E R T. You get it? So you have to transfer it if you use white. But it looks super big. It worked. Um, the back like went through the shirt or either this shirt was dirty before some way somehow so i'm just putting the words on right now and that's the last thing to wrap up this video make sure you apply slight pressure i look a mess somebody do my hair please please but this is the shirt you see light transfer paper it's still see-through kind of but people like that for some reason you see it you can see it you see where it goes where is that but this is a medium but i must have got this from walmart or something because why is it so big y'all like i always get medium and it seems big as crap but here you go look that's what i'm saying it burned through or this must already been dirty so i'm gonna just wash it the complex illustration be a part of our jewels I made this design. This is like four different images. One, two, three, four put together. This is actually one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Actually it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Cause I put four different hearts. I have to do three different letters, three and three different texts. Put the rainbow in the church chest. So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. You want to work with me if you like these videos comment and let me know i'll spice it up show y'all the ins and the outs the do's and the do's nots you see it you see it hey if you ain't subscribing you watching this